What's up, Sloshies? It's your boy, Wacky Waffle, back again with the next episode of our NCAA series. If you don't recall from last episode, we started this new uh, series here as an offensive coordinator for UTSA Roadrunners, and we played two games. We played against uh, New Mexico, beat them, and then we had a crazy upset win over Oklahoma State. So that brings us here to our to a bye week. We also have an upgrade here that we got after we won our last game, so we got to figure out what we want to put this into. Uh, I think I want to keep it in the injury because we didn't really have a, uh, any fumble problems. The only time we fumbled was with our quarterback being sacked, but besides that, it wasn't that much of an issue, so I think we're going to keep putting points into up-tempo to keep our players from getting hurt. Let's also check our conference standings here, see where we're where we are. So... Uh, yeah, nobody's played any conference games yet. So far, us and UAB are the only two that are undefeated. Uh, UAB's pretty good. Is everybody else in here one star? Louisiana Tech is a three-star prestige. I think they might be the best school. No, UAB's the best school in here. So UAB's probably going to be the school to beat whenever we play them. Penn State is up to three. Uh, that means Alabama must have lost. They're one and one. Florida's up to four. Oregon's at five. Florida's two and oh. Any other surprises in, in the top 25 here, or is everything basically what you would expect? Yeah, basically looks like what you would expect out of a typical top 25, besides Penn State being at three. It looks like we're a little bit better overall-wise. Offense is pretty solid. Defense looks to be about balanced, but our offense should be better than theirs. Defense gets stopped. Try, starting to get used to seeing that. Let's go ahead and open up with a run here. It's always how our offense works. We always open up with a run. Seeing how McCormick will do. Got a whole four yard rush. Not too bad. The triple option here. Able to get it, pitch it. Ah, nothing's there for McCormick. But he does truck forward and get a yard. McCormick always falls forward. He's just, he's a beast. I have no idea how U UTSA was able to recruit this guy. He must have either been like a really lucky recruit or he is just developed super well. But I'm not complaining. So third down and five here. Let's see if we can get something going. McCormick should have this. Nope, he drops it. So it looks like we're going three and out first possession here. See what we can do with it. Hopefully we can actually move the ball this time. Nowhere. Nowhere for McCormick again. McCormick makes a great grab around the defender. First down, 12-yard reception for him. Narcisse has also been playing pretty good. Like, he was the third string guy. I mean, if you guys didn't see last episode. Third string guy, and he's... Playing pretty solid. Like, look at that throw. That's a dime right there. Dart. Zakari Franklin. No, Narcisse is going to have a touchdown. Wide open. Now untouched into the end zone for a touchdown. That was a gr great play design. They're great blocking. Everything was perfect. Hand the ball off. McCormick, another big gain. 10 yard, 11 yard rush. If we can keep chunking them like that, that's huge. Running the play action here. See if we can get something right there. Wide open. Watson. Breaks a tackle. Gets a block. Breaks spins off of another tackle. First and goal. 31 yard reception. What a gain. What a gain. Let's go. End of the first quarter. 7 nothing. We might be able to have this wheel route outside of the backfield. Yeah, we do. McCormick with the catch. Oh, great. Great tackle right there. I thought he was in, but I guess the tackle. Third and goal from the one yard line. We're definitely going for this on fourth down if we don't get it. As long as we don't lose two yards. Heck, even if we lose two yards, I'm going for it. Wow, they're not even running a goal line defense. Easy touchdown. That was surprising. I thought they were going to put up put up some goal, some sort of goal line, but I mean, I'll take it. 14 nothing. Defense gets another stop. On the curl route, Franklin's open. Gets a first down. Oh, that should have been picked off. Fourth down and eight. Running slants here again. See if we can get anything. But it looks like they're playing a zone, so we might have to just run it. Oh, good move. Narcisse gets trucked, though. 
Gotta learn how to slide. Finally expecting the run. Let's hit him with a play action. Tight end should be open. Good catch for Watson. First and goal. 15-yard reception. We're moving up and down the field against Uchek right now. This is crazy. 10 for 12 passing, 124 yards. See if we can get one in the end zone here. Get him a touchdown pass. Nobody's really open. Coming across there. Great. Look at that. Look at that. Dart. Dart in the end zone. We're, we're running away with it. 21 nothing. It's not even halftime yet. What are they reviewing? Uh, 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 <laughs> he didn't, they were trying to say he didn't make the catch. I would hope it stands. <laughs> I would hope so. Okay. Franklin's got press coverage, so let's see if that safety comes. Nope. But they blitz, so we have the out open. Watson just trucks that safety. He's not even there. <laughs> That safety literally just disappeared. Oh, I guess the coach wants to go for it. Honestly, oh, they're, they're piling up for the run. Let's get some uh, sort of quick pass going. Good catch. Franklin gets the catch. First down and 10. Seven-yard reception. We get the first down. Dingle with the catch. Touchdown. Let's go. This game's getting out of hand. 27 to nothing in the third quarter. Oh, and he throws an interception. Good thing the game's kind of out of hand. Sharp with the catch, and he dives, and he's in. Another touchdown. Give us that touchdown back. Give us that touchdown back, UTEP. And there we go. We win the game. 3-0. Get our third straight. UTEP falls. Narcisse is the player of the game. 241 yards, 4 carries, 39 yards, and 4 total touchdowns. He played really solid today besides that interception. But defense played lights out. They only gave up a touchdowns in garbage time. It doesn't really matter that much. McCormick played pretty good. He didn't get as many carries today as he should have probably. But, you know, he still made an impact. Still, had, still did pretty solid. All right, so we're hopping in here. See if we can go 4-0. Oh. Houston is a higher overall than us. Off, our offense is a little bit better, but their defense is significantly on paper better than ours. But our defense has been playing really, really, really good. So they're leaving a gaping hole in the middle. Don't Didn't they read the scouting report? Only gets three yards. Nobody's open. We're going to throw it away. Fourth and seven. Nothing going there. Three and out for us. Opening drive. Audible out of it. Right there. Wide open. Makes the catch. Cephas. 23-yard reception. Huge play. Third and one. McCormick gets it. Not really much room there, but he got the job done. Always falls forward. McCormick right there. Maybe he can get the first. He does. Eight yard reception. First and ten. Inside the red zone now. So that's good. On the in route. Watson's right there and he's in. Touchdown. Now we're talking. Now we are in business. Three for six passing. 44 yards one touchdown. Got Dingle on the catch. 15-yard reception. That's the end of the first quarter. Up 7 nothing. That's a bad throw. Fourth and inches. We're definitely going for this. Definitely going for this. Oh, I guess we're not going for it. <laughs> they score. 7-7. Seven to seven. Defense finally lets up a touchdown. And we get sacked. I was I had McCormick open too. I had like two more seconds. McCormick gets it. 
He's got blockers. And he gets 12, which is good, but not enough. Fourth and nine. Maybe we can get somebody. Op oh, right there. Nobody's playing defense on him. Jones with the catch. He breaks a tackle. Huge play. 42 yards. Now we're talking. Let's go. Finally, we get something going. We haven't been able to get anything going. Got him there. Watson drops it. He had it in his arms and dropped it. Fourth and ten. And we missed the field goal. We do get a stop, though. They look like they were moving, but that, that hurts. Drops the open touchdown, and then we don't make the field goal. Wow. Brady with a good run here, though. Six-yard carry. We need to get out of the slump. We made the big play, and we just couldn't capitalize off of it. Run this play action again. Got him there. Dingle with the catch. Dingle's got a space. 27-yard reception. Big gain. Great throw in stride. And he just kind of burned the defender for a while there. Pitch it to McCormick. McCormick trucks a man. He's still going. Breaks another tackle. 14-yard rush. Now we're, now we're moving the ball now. Let's go. Hit him with the play action. Watson finally catches a pass. Man hasn't been able to like catch like anything. We got him on the slant. Cephas with the catch. Stiff arms a man and he's in for a touchdown. He's open, maybe. No. Intercepted. He didn't even make a play for the ball. That's not very good. They're in great field position. Defense needs to come up clutch. I think can win this one. No. But he looks like he could be open. Dingle with the catch. He misses the tackle and Dingle's gone. Dingle is gone. That should be ball game 21 to 7. The clock stops on first downs. McCormick can't get the first. Fourth and one. We do get the field goal, though. They do score a touchdown. 21 to 24. That field goal will win us the game. We get the ball back. 20 seconds left. All we have to do is kneel, and the game is over. And that'll do it. Houston did put up a pretty good fight there, but we were able to come, come through with that field goal to, at the end there. 24-21 final. I think that should put us into 2-0 in our conference play. Narcisse player of the game, 10 for 27, 233 yards and three touchdowns. Great game for him. But anyways, guys, that's going to end this episode here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Please like and also comment something about the video. You know, I like having conversations with you guys in the uh, comment section. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. I hope you all have a great day. Uh, and, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.